Hello everyone. Uh, <clears throat> in this video, we will be studying about combination of dialectics. Okay. Combination of dialectics lab. Okay. Where uh, we will be studying two cases. The first one is. Division by plate separation, division of plate separation, you can say. And the next one is division of plate area. Right. So uh, we'll first take the case number one. Okay. Division of plate separation. Suppose. This is your capstan, and your uh, plate length, or you can say plate separation, has been divided in two parts. So this is distance t1, this is distance d2, dielectric constant k1, k2, and this is your distance p. Now you need to find uh, capstan. Capacitance equivalent capacitance for this case. So now uh, you can uh, draw this okay as a two capacitor connected in series, right? Remember one thing when they will be divided uh, by plate separation, okay, then there will be equal charge distribution, that means they will be in series, and when they will be divided uh, by plate area, then there will be potential difference will be equal okay so uh, they will be connected in parallel in this case they are divided uh, they are uh, divi there is a division of plate separation so they will be having same charge okay if charge q flows from here this, these two will get these two dielectric will get same charge okay so they will be in series okay? and having capstan c1 and c2 the point a point here also point b point a Okay, now having uh, dielectric constant k1 distance t1 t2 dielectric constant k2 right now equivalent capacitance it will be c equivalent is equals to k1 k2 c1 c2 upon c1 plus c2 okay now c1 will be epsilon naught a1 a1 by a1 a is actually same so it will be a this is your c1 multiplied by c2 will be epsilon naught k2 a by c2 divided by c1 plus c2 epsilon naught k1 a by d1 plus not k a by c2 okay now, to take epsilon of a common and if you cancel them, okay, they will not be cancelled. Sorry, so this will become epsilon not a. If you take epsilon not a common here, uh, they will be cancelled. Okay, so this will become epsilon not a divided by and uh. K1, K2 upon D1, D2, they will also get uh, cancelled out. Okay, so this will the final result will be. I'm directly writing it. K2. This will be your valent capacitance when they are separated. Okay. Now you can also generate special cases if D1 equal to D2 equal to D by 2, the C equivalent will be. You can get it okay then c equivalent will be i think a harmonic mean of k1 k2 okay you can derive it as well okay now the taking on our second case division of plate area right see uh, when they will be separated by plate area then 
what will be same the potential difference this will be same and they will be connected in parallel right so this is a capstar and they are divided somewhat like this k1 to k2 this is distance b point a point b okay so they will be connected in parallel point b point a now uh, and this will be your c1 which is k1 epsilon not k1 by d and this will be c2 equal to see they will be separated and they will be divided by area okay there is a division of plate area so in this case your distance d this will be same and area will be different c2 will be k2 epsilon not a2 by again your equivalent capacitance will be the summation of both c1 plus c2 equivalent so if you take epsilon naught by d common this will be k1 a1 plus a2 a2 see this is a generalized equation okay if uh, they are divided in n terms okay suppose a1 a2 a3 a4 and so on then equivalent capacitance will be epsilon naught by d in bracket k1 a1 plus k2 a2 plus k3 k3 a3 plus k4 a4 and so on okay that will be your equivalent capacitance and uh, similar to first case if uh, they are separated in n suppose d1 d2 d3 d4 and so on up to dn okay they are divided in n n plate sequence okay then again equivalent capacitance will be epsilon naught a by d1 by k1 plus d2 by k2 plus dt3 d3 by k3 plus d4 by k4 and so on up to dn by kn right this was your uh, when uh, they will be separated by plate area okay and again special cases you can take here how if a1 equal to a2 equal to a by 2 then your special case okay i will tell you If a1 equal to a2 equal to a by 2, then c equivalent will be epsilon naught a upon 2d k1 plus k2. Okay. That means your c equivalent will be k equivalent multiplied by epsilon naught a by here your k equivalent is k1 plus k2 that means arithmetic mean of k1 and k2 similar to the previous case your k equivalent was actually in this case k equivalent will be 2 k1 k2 you can derive this okay just put the value of d1 equal to d1 equal to d2 equal to d by 2 actually a special case okay k equivalent will be 2 k1 k2 by k1 plus k2 that means harmonic mean of k1 and So uh, these were the following terms. Okay. So continuing uh, in the next video, we'll be doing problems related to this. Okay. Thank you.